start, I just wanted to... There's something on my screen. I don't know how to make it go away. Oh. Hey, it's my brother. Hi, brother. Um, to start, I've got to set up my whole lathe. I'm going to set everything up just so you guys can see how I do that. So let's go. I could keep my lathe like hold to my wall. I know a lot of people do. But as a content creator, I need space to move the camera basically all around so I can get good good shots and stuff. Um, plus, it just puts way too much shavings and stuff on the actual wall, and I hate cleaning it all up. This way, it all just falls to the floor basically, and I'm good to go. So... Plus, I'm probably going to put you guys over here. Anyways, so. Okay, and I'm going to need my spur bit. There we go. There we go. We're just going to be turning between centers. Hi, brother. <laughs> Thanks for jumping in, Josh. Uh, we're going to be turning between centers, and we're going to use our little thing. So pretty easy. And um, so we're going to be turning this into this, hopefully. I made this uh, about six months ago, and I made two of them, uh, but I only turned one. Couldn't tell you why. So, anyways, <clears throat> first thing I got to do is I got to find the center of the squares, which is pretty easy. Just need a pencil and something straight. I'll just use this giant square to do it. Usually I do this on my bench, but uh, I think I can do it here, at least decently well. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Got it. Decently well. Hope everybody's having a good Saturday. I know I am. Spent a lot of time not in the shop today, and it was kind of nice. I've been really frustrated with Instagram. Instagram has just been annoying. So I'm doing more YouTube. All right. I'm going to move you. Over here. Don't get sick. Okay. Hopefully you can see everything. I don't know because... Oh yeah. That's pretty good. I think we're going to need to move you over here. Three people in here. Who are my three people? I know one's my brother. Hashtag family support family. Radar the Wood Turner, what's up? Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right. Um, What am I doing? What am I doing? Oh, yeah. The only hard thing about this... Turning. Oh, that's what I was doing. I was bringing this down lower because you can't see what I'm doing. There we go. 
The only hard thing about this turning such a small object is uh, it's basically the size of my tool rest, so. So. And you know what else I forgot to do? Please let me pull this out. Ah, oh, dang it. Man, it's like this is my first time ever wood turning. Jeez. I like to handle this in to my piece first. Center. Because I'm pretty sure you should do this when you're turning. And then I just take this cheap little awl that I have and I poke a hole right about center here as well. Just so my other side can line up pretty well. All right. I'll get there. I'll be good at this one day, I promise. All right. This guy goes in, and this guy goes in. Lock that down. Lock, lock. Okay, this doesn't have lock. There we go. Don't want that going anywhere. All right, I think we're good. Okay. Pick up my tools. And yes, I will wear, not goggles, but a mask, full mask. Dirty. Am I missing anything? I feel like I'm missing something. Like chat. No. No missing any chat. Let's go. Let's go. go, go. Alright, let's get started. Oh. <laughs> I kind of need to plug my lathe in. Alright, let's see how fast we can turn this thing. I feel like it should be fairly fast. Crank this speed up a little more. I don't I don't want this tool. I don't know why I thought this would be a good tool. This is the tool that I want. Round carbide tip tool. Oh no! Oh no, I lost my grip on my thing. Dang it. So when that happens, yeah. Wow, that's awful. Basically, this whole thing just stripped out. Real cool. Give me a thumbs up. Make sure you guys like the video. Dang it. Dang. I didn't even think. Man. So, now we're just going to get this out and rehammer it back in, I guess. And I think part of that problem Come on! There you go. I think part of that problem is just that it A, wasn't in far enough and B, wasn't tight enough.
I think I need to back this up. Three. Need to put just a little more pressure on this bad boy. Oh, I see what some of the problem is. My tailstock is moving. That's interesting. Okay. Lock this down, too. All right, let's see if that does it for us, huh? I'll try to be a little less aggressive. I'm going to pick this speed up a little more. I think also. So I'm just cutting out the basic shape now. Let's see where we're at. Are we round? Almost. A couple flat spots. But we are getting there. So the goal is to just get this thing basically to round, and I just want it to just get to round. I don't want it to get any smaller than it has to be, if that makes sense. I think I'm pretty close. Yeah. Okay, where's my... So I need, I want to have this close by so I can reference it. Alright, we are round, which is perfect. I did a really good job on this. This is my first one. 
Looks like I cut off a lot, though. Dang. All right. Cool, 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 cool. Put this right there. Hopefully it doesn't fall. It's going to fall. Hello. Man, how cool are acorns? They're so cool. I think, at least. Diamond tipped carbide cutting tool just to get this thing like real nice and rounded off in there. I'm going to have to do a little sanding, obviously, but... There we go. I think that looks good. I think that looks real good. Uh, let's separate the... I want to try and make this look like the top is, like, sitting on top of it. Like, with this one, the you can tell it's on there, but I want it to have a little bit more of a lip around the top of it. So, trying to think how to how to do that, and I think I need to push. This up. And push this down, I think. Okay, I know what I'm doing. So we're going to really cut that like that. I think. I am by no means an expert in acorns, so you just have to bear with me on this. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. I want... Hold on, I gotta think this through. I gotta think this through before I take off way too much material. How is this done? This guy goes down. Oh, maybe I should focus on this part first, then. is just round this part over. Get this top kind of figured out. And then focus on the connection, I guess. I'd like a little bit more of a stem in here if I could. Hey, I've got a new viewer. Who's here? Nancy. Hey, Nancy. How do I sharpen my tips? Yeah, I just replace them after uh, after they get to a dull point. So, like, uh, these tips, they you just unscrew them, and you can rotate them, 
And then when you get to a point where you think that they're done, you just throw them away and then get a new one. Uh, message me on... Sorry, I'm like way up here. <laughs> message me on Instagram and I can send you a link to these exact turning tools if you're interested. And they gave me a discount code for all of you guys. So, if you have turning, sup? I'm trying to work out this acorn. I made this acorn like six months ago. And um, I, wanna, I wanna make another one, obviously. I had another blank for this acorn. And so I'm just, Trying to figure it out. I want the top to look like it's like, like, I don't know how to even put it, like bubbly on top of this. So I think I'm going to work this top a little bit. I would like a little bit more of a stem. There's a tiny bit of a stem on here, but I'd like a little bit more. So that's what we're working on next. So... I think we're going to make our stem be about there. A little bit less, maybe. Something like that. And then, if I can do this right, I can just roll this top like that. And then if I can do it this way. I don't know. I don't like it. Let's use a different tool. Let's use this bad boy. Yep, that's definitely the right tool for the job. Okay, that's looking better. Okay, I think that this part needs to come in a little bit. The actual acorn part of it needs to come in. Because it looks like... Oh, man, it's so... it's. <laughs> I'm, I think I'm thinking about this too much, is what I'm doing. Right, chat? Like, I'm just thinking about it way too much, man. Not to mention, I can't see out of my stupid face shield. It's all dusty. Plus, I think I need more light over here. Luckily, I have multiple lights in here. There we go. Hopefully, it's not too bright for you guys there. Five people in the chat now. What's going on? Let me know who you are and what is your favorite color. Too personal? <laughs> all right. Got this thing cleaned up. All right, acorn, acorn. Make the acorn. Yeah, this thing is sweet. It's nice and fat, so I like it. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. That's huge. bring my speed down now that I'm getting into detail work.
Okay, I'm digging that. I think that's looking good. Now I need to, actually I think I need to remove a little bit more material just so I can get this to like bubble over if that makes any sense at all. But I think it's looking good. Now I have to move this light because I need to get over here for this angle. Nice. Actually, man, I feel like I'm just like one bad move away from ruining this thing for some reason. Oh no, it's getting loose. No wonder it's so acting funny. There we go. Back on track. Um... Okay, I think I just need to blend this in. I think. What do you guys think? Looks pretty decent. I think. Is it an acorn? <laughs> I need to take a look. Yeah, I think it just needs to get grounded out here a little bit more. And yeah. This one I made like pretty flat on the top. And this one I rounded out. I think it looks a little bit better. So... Oh, that's what I did differently. I'm pretty sure I turned this acorn like this because I have like a little dot there. So I'm not going to do that here. I'm just going to have to flatten this one, this side out. But yeah, I'm going to do a little bit more detail work and I think we're good. I don't think it's bad, right? It's not bad. I should make up like 10 of these, 10 of these. And uh, I think that what you think is what I think. Name that movie besides Josh. Name that movie. Um, yeah, I'm just going to do a little more detail work, and then I think this thing's good, dude. I think it looks snazzy, jazzy. Am I lame? A little bit. Yeah, I definitely think that was something I didn't like was how aggressive this came to a point. I just rounded it out, and I think that looks phenomenal. Dang it. I went too far. It's technically say instead of thing, but still say. Yes, yes. No, is it? Oh, yeah, you're right. No, actually, I think I just nailed that perfectly, dude. A little funky, but I think it works. I think it works, and I think I'm just going to deal with this a little bit more. I think we're good to go, yo.
I say over Houston is what I say. All right, and I think that's it, you guys. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you like it? It looks like an acorn to me. I mean, compared to its brother, it's a little bit bigger, which I like. Um, but I think it works. Again, I mean, it's an acorn. All acorns are different, right? So I'm just going to get this thing sanded up. And we're good to go. So I'm just going to blow it off. I think I'm going to go for it. Oh, gosh, I almost dropped this acorn. I think I'm just going to call the video there. Because I can reattach this thing on in just a minute. But I don't want this video to be so long. You know? <laughs> and that is how you turn an acorn. <laughs> it looks sweet, dude. I like it. Yeah, I'm going to have to sand this little hole here and sand this down here on the disc sander or something, but it'll be all right. Cool. Well, um... Uh... Let me know what you guys think. I appreciate all your comments. I appreciate the likes. And yeah, check out my other videos that I've posted and stuff. Uh, I am definitely trying to dive more into YouTube this year than I have in the past years. Uh, simply because I love YouTube. I've always loved YouTube. Um, and I want to be a bigger part of the community on here. So anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I... Uh, I had fun. I hope you had fun. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next live. I'll try and do more of these more often. So cool looks pretty good. Thanks. I think it looks pretty good. So it'll look much, much better once I sand it and get it oiled up. So yeah, I think I'm going to go do that over on Instagram live or maybe TikTok. I'm not sure. But if you guys are following me on Instagram, stay tuned. Take it easy, everyone. Yes, everybody be good, be safe, be happy, and uh, feel free to reach out to me anytime with questions, concerns, comments, uh, if you want to Venmo me or just, you know, <laughs> just kidding. Anyways, guys, bye. Uh, and.